happy for nearly 10 years. <laughs> So I'm here with one of the guys that probably got me into dance music, one of my favourite guys. We always catch up and I've never put him on a video, Mauro Picotto. Mauro. Hi everyone, ciao, I'm Mauro Picotto in Ibiza with my friend. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people always say in the comments, especially when I do club stuff, they talk about your night. What was it like in the yeah. early days? It was before my time, unfortunately. It was like more like the lifestyle of Ibiza, the spirit of Ibiza. And uh, completely different than now, obviously with this unprecedented situation of the yeah. COVID. But uh, I, for me, is I left part of my life here. That's why yeah, I yeah. always come back and I enjoy because I see my friend. We speak about business to do something in, in the next few years if we want or not. You know, it, yeah. it's still alive. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But obviously, the situation is different now, and we have to deal with it. Yeah, yeah. And how do you like? How does it compare? Like, how do? At what point in life when? You know, you had probably 10,000 people and privilege, or uh, how, how busy was it back then? It was busy because you starting, you know, like we were starting on the Wednesday and finished on the Friday. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because it was non-stop every day. But uh, you need to deal with, as I say, with what is the situation now. And now the situation is like you have to optimize all the time and the opportunity you have. At the same time, I dedicate more time again to the music, yeah. to producing, because I don't want to I don't produce anymore so much club music yeah, yeah, because yeah. Uh, the club music uh, with the club clothes you cannot experience the wa the vibe and you can see even in the techno everybody is making track from 20 years ago yeah. in a new just with a kick for me that is even no techno it's just yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. it's like uh, old school re-update and it's fine but uh, if you want to make new music you have to uh, experiment more and taste it in the club yeah you can't at the moment and that's why I dedicate more to commercial in the way music for the radio, music to listen, music to remember. Yeah, yeah. Because if you don't remember music, it's not a key right, you know. And what you said as well, like you always seem to, obviously you have a place here and we always catch up when you're over. Um, what takes you back to the island? Uh, what takes me back is the spirit. Like you, when you're here, you feel the, free, the freedom, the, the vibe of the... the, the you know, there, there's something special. Here. Yeah, yeah. You know, I'm like, uh, I, f I fell in love when I came the first time, like over 25 years ago, and I, you know, have a house and I still come back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's amazing. And like, how is this whole situation, which has destroyed me and financially, but how has it affected you as a DJ? Because obviously, you have to travel. Are you traveling as much now? Obviously, I, I, I'm more based in UK, obviously, in the way that uh, we just restarted now. I've been yeah. the last gig was for me last year in August in Italy. Now Italy is still in lockdown in a way for the club. Yeah. But uh, England is open, we're doing festival, we have a cream field, we will do we did creaming a red car, we have a Planet Love in Belfast. Yeah. We're going to Glasgow at the end of September. So the life looks back but the inside club, you know like the cover club yeah, yeah, yeah. is my worry because it's still no a, a clear idea of what's going on. Yeah yeah. I think I, if I can somehow make it, I'm going to try and come to Belfast because I haven't seen my mother for two years. So that would be the ideal scenario. Get the, the, the same way for me. Visa was uh, I, I saw my my daughter after one year here in Ibiza. Ah, uh, yeah, I seen the picture. Yeah. After one year, I managed to see my daughter again because I couldn't go back to Italy because if I go back, I have to do quarantine there, quarantine here. So it was yeah. like impossible to deal. And, and here was easier and we reconnect we have obviously and what's your just to wrap it up because obviously we're just having a quite casual chat and um, what would be your sort of three things that you like about like what you do in Ibiza like what's the when you when you miss the island when you come back obviously you come home but like oh, is there any restaurants first, or first to spend time in the sea yeah you know like I, I love to be all day on, on the water more than in the water yeah yeah uh, second, the food because I like to enjoy my dinner on the beach or in some nice restaurant, and uh, the rest is like just chill out. Yeah. Because it's uh, it's not just about the club, Ibiza, or especially now. I mean, the last two years I still come back to Ibiza because yeah, yeah. Ibiza is beautiful. There's no story. Yeah, that, yeah, it is. The 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 thing is we need to see in the next few years how they gonna rebuild if they wanna rebuild. Yeah, yeah. The the, the club scene of as it was or they will change the strategy it would be very interesting to see yeah 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 no but thanks for uh, taking the You're time very as well because always we have a good catch up um, i hope the people that watch my vlogs have enjoyed the fact that maro's here 
Um, you still produce the music, you know, you released a track the other day as well, which I loved. It's, it just it took you through a journey. Uh, I haven't I, used it on the video yet. I, but like the pro I like to experiment in the way that I um, try to be creative. It doesn't yeah. matter where it's going to take me the music, but I want the music that I believe. Yeah. You know, music that I it will stay with the time, not just you yeah, know, yeah. a loop and it's made for the loopy people. <laughs> and you, me you mentioned as well, some people leave you like nasty comments. I I'm starting to get that a lot now. Like what, what you advice do you, you You will always have like 80% that maybe like you and 20 no. Yeah. But that's this, everything, politician, everything is always, you will never put everybody together. Yeah, uh, yeah. But you will try to make what you, in what you believe. We try to give a good emotion to the people, good vibe, good experience. And then obviously there's people jealous and will always be people jealous around and we try always to give uh, bad things or bad karma. Yeah. But I'm a positive person, not for COVID obviously yeah, at the yeah. moment, but in that way be good and uh, you know the bad things always turn around to the other people. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to think in that, but I just want to be the person that try to give good emotion a good uh, experience good memory yeah yeah yeah. especially with the music you know when you play music some people take the easy option or the you know but yeah, yeah. do what i believe is more important for me. yeah no thank you very much You're Mario. Very welcome. um thanks for the nice Cheers. we're gonna enjoy a drink um yeah i've obviously i don't need to explain who this man is this is the guy like i said your track how, how actually how do those tracks how do you make a track that's for a lifetime all your tracks, those early day tracks are all because they're played today. Yeah, because it, for me the music needs to stay with the time. Yeah. Because I also, you know, I, I, I went to trance, I went to into techno, I went to try to house music. I always try to, to, to experience because it's you know music I'm not following genre. For me yeah. gen one genre only is limited. You know, it's easy to say, Oh just play techno, boom boom boom. But it's yeah, not yeah. that. For me the music is music. You have to be a journey and that's why I only respect few real DJ that know how to play good music. I think the first time that I discovered your music, I was a kid um, and I used to go to this pub and my dad would pick me up after and we would go and play pool and there was a jukebox and it was always, I think it was Lizard, but it was always that, that was that, that track and then that's how I discover every day, every day we'd go, me and my cousin to play uh, and then here we are sat in Ibiza 20 odd years later. It's crazy, but see, thank you. Hopefully to see you again in 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> hopefully. The way this summer's going, I don't know where I'm going to be in 20 years. But yeah, thank you very much, Mauro. And uh, yeah, all the best. I'm going to put uh, things in the description. If you've, you can send me any of your gigs that are up and coming. A lot of people in the UK watch my vlogs and they'll exactly know who yeah, you if are. You're, if you're, you're going to be for in England for Greenfield, I will be there on the Friday. Yeah. See you in Greenfield or Belfast for Planet Love. Perfect. Thank you, man. Ciao.